Our fourth If You Give a Child a Book campaign wraps up today. We are collecting donations from the community, which will be turned into brand new books for local students in need. For four years now, this campaign has encouraged kids to read. KSBY anchor Janelle Padilla spoke with the local school, which has been part of this effort since the beginning. It's just always a fun time when we have the book fair. Principal Ron Smith knows the drill when it comes to the annual If You Give a Child a Book campaign, with the school being a part of it since the beginning. The, the KSBOI Give a Child a Book campaign is important to students because we're able to get books every year and we put those in the hands of students and these students might not otherwise have these books. The fourth book campaign is well underway and for some students, just because they know what to expect doesn't mean there's any less excitement. Reading is something that I really love doing. I can read and then I could, I could picture everything that's happening in the book because of all the details the book gives me. Ashley Magallon is building quite the library as she's been through the campaign before. But for fifth grader Alicia Lopez, it's her very first one. It brings me joy knowing that I'm able to read them and I can start and I can reread them as much as times as I want to. All of the teachers here at Ariana Elementary are excited to support this program. It also emphasizes the importance of early literacy, which is uh, something that we're all about here at Ariana Elementary School. As fifth grade teacher Jennifer Cruz puts it, reading comprehension has always been a priority at Ariana's. The book campaign just amplifies that. They are so excited when they get to open those brand new books and they now know the genres of books that they like and they're really excited every year for the event. And Cruz says as a school, it's really cultivated a joy of literacy. We now have a family reading night that we do annually every year and we even have a book vending machine. So it's really inspired that love of reading. Janelle Padilla, KSBY News. And we are in our final hours of accepting donations. Here is how you can get involved. It's easy. Just scan the QR code on your screen and follow the link to our website. Or you can text KSBY to 50155. All proceeds go to buying new books for local students in need. And here at KSBY, we are excited to announce the results of our One Day Blitz Donation Day. The community showed up big on Wednesday, donating more than $17,000 to the book campaign. With the Scripps Howard Fund match, that is more than $35,000. We want to extend a big thank you to everyone in the community who has donated so far.